let f of x equal the square root of 1 minus sine x. Write the equation for the tangent line of f at x equals 0. So x equals 0 is our point of tangency. The first thing we need is to find the y1 that goes along with this x1. So y1 equals f of 0 which is square root of 1 minus sine of 0, which is square root of 1 minus 0, square root of 1, which is 1. So this is, we have our x1 and our y1. So now remember, in order to find our slope of our tangent line, we need our derivative of this function. And remember, this function is 1 minus sine x to the 1 half. So f prime of x, we're going to need some power rule of chain rule, 1 half, 1 minus sine x to the negative 1 half times the derivative of what's on the inside, 0 minus cosine x. So simplifying that, that is negative cosine x over 2 square root 1 minus sine x. So now our slope of our tangent line is going to be our derivative at 0, which is negative cosine of 0 over 2 square root 1 minus sine of 0, which is negative 1 over 2 square root 1, or negative 1 half. So now that we have x1, y1, and m, so we're still working on part B right now. Y minus Y1 equals M times X minus X1. So that's Y minus 1 equals negative 1 half X minus 0. And that is the equation of our tangent line. So now for part E, they want the equation for the normal line. So we still have our same x1 and y1 as 0, 1, x1, y1. But our slope is going to be the perpendicular slope of our tangent line, which is the opposite reciprocal, 2. So our normal line formula is going to be y minus 1 equals 2 times x minus 0. So let's just note this is the tangent line, and this is the normal line, which is perpendicular to our tangent line.